Hi, I'm Robert Malthy with Malthy's Minute on the Market. According to the Brookings Institute, Islamic terrorism, uh, the movement uh, initiated uh, in the 18th century with Muhammad Abin Ava, uh, with his teachings, um, trying to cleanse a what he believed a corrupt and polluted uh, Islam. And today, fast forward to 2007, and many of the, the leaders of, of ISIS have adopted those principles with the basic idea that if you were an unbeliever, an idolater, or apostate, then you must be taken out and your wealth confiscated. Never has the right in the United States, the Second Amendment rights to bear arms, been more important than today. And we are seeing an increasing uptrend based on recent events uh, globally in Paris, Egypt, and Mali. As, as people, the unarmed citizens notice, quoting a survivor from the Bar uh, incident in Paris, they were shooting us like birds. Many are taking note and exercising their constitutional Second Amendment right and also further looking at their right to carry. If you look at trends from 1970, uh, the, the level of gun ownership to today, that has declined by about 5%. If that trend just reverses to 1970 le levels, we should have a significant pickup in, 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 in sales of guns and ammunition in this country. People are realizing that with our open borders and our immigration policies and the administration's uh, desire to bring in immigrants, 54% of the population in a recent survey opposed that. Their action, we believe, will be to think it through and to exercise their Second Amendment right. One of the big beneficiaries is an old line U.S. company, Smith & Wesson. They're the leading uh, sales company of handguns. They are right in the middle of this. We expect them to increase uh, quite significantly. Uh, they have beaten earnings estimates the last 18 quarters and recently have guided higher. In the last two or three months we're starting to see these trends take hold and this is before Paris where sales in the last couple of months increased 18 percent evidenced by registrations at the NCIS. A big part of this increase and in boom is from women. That is over 20 percent of the growth as women are wanting to exercise their right to defend themselves as well. Come to our website millenniumasset.biz and, and pick up our latest report uh, from the Brookings Institute on this serious, serious subject, and also we'll have a report on Smith & Wesson with our target price. Happy Thanksgiving. This is Robert Maltby with Maltby's Minute on the Market.